Hi everyone, today we're going to be making this really cool sensory bottle and it has oil, water, glitter, and food coloring. Hope you enjoy. Let's get on with the video. So, how you make these bottles are, you're going to need a bottle like this. You can get these at Michael's for about $2. You'll need some glitter or like something sparkly. I recommend glitter, but you don't have to add it. You'll need some type of food coloring. Um, I'm using this pink because it's for my sister. You can use gel or like the watery type. You need oil. You can use mineral oil or baby oil. I'm using mineral. And you'll need some water. Let's get to it. So, I filled my bottle a little less than halfway full. Now, if you have gel food coloring like me, you're going to want to shake it. If you have a more watery food coloring, then you can kind of watch it. But I have gel, so I have to shake this. Just going to get that food coloring in there. I want a more red than pink, so I'm going to have to add a lot more. So quickly, just want to shake it really hard. I want to make sure it's all the way close to it. Like this. Kind of looks like an orange, but it's like a red. I think that's a good color. Now we're going to pour in oil. Like this. Carefully. You're going to tip it just a little bit. Just gonna pour in about half of like the container, like this much. So about the same amount on each side. And I don't think it should fill it all the way just because it looks better if you don't. Now I'm just going to add some of these glitters. I'm not gonna add too much of them, but I'm going to add some. Just gonna add some of those. I think I'm gonna add all of these just because it will really go with the color. And I'm going to come back when I get all the glitters in. Now that I have all the glitter in, you kind of just want to like mix it around in a little foil, like this, and the water. Lightly and not too hard. Like this, and the glitter goes around. And that's how you make a sensory bottle. I want to make sure this is tight and my sister doesn't spill this everywhere. So I'm going to hot glue the top. I just hot glued the top on. Make sure if you're also hot gluing it on that either an adult or somebody you knows knows so that you don't hurt yourself. But I hot glued it on and you just want to make sure it stays on there for a little bit so that it dries. And it also dries really quickly, so you got to be careful about that. And that's how you make this sensory bottle. I think it's so cool. It has the coolest colors. I like how it's like pink and kind of orange at the bottom. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. Bye, guys!